Hello and welcome back my people! We are here, you're here rather, with the Insured Gamer. Uh, we are playing another playthrough here of FAR. Um, it is a game that we just started up uh, not too long ago, uh, very new to it. Don't know too much about it other than what was given on the Xbox uh, Game Pass preview. Uh, last episode, um, we, we did start out, really the game hasn't given us much of anything other than we're we're here in an underground, or were in an underground town and our city uh, that has been flooded by water. Uh, we went into an underground like little base, sucked up some water, got basically a, a neck ring and uh, probably our tracking device, but it allows us to, to go a little bit faster in water. Can I run? I wish I could run. So I'm a little slow on land. No, nope, it doesn't look like I can run, but in the water, Press the space bar and you get to go a little faster. Yeah, there we go. That's nice. It's kind of nice. But yeah, here's our here's our little town. It looks like it's just been completely demolished by water. So that's about all we know for now. So <laughs> we're gonna play a little bit and I uh, hope you enjoy. Be strong. Be strong. Alright, so let's get started off uh, where we left off. Again, got our little neck race ring. Our tracking device is what I believe it is. Uh, and we'll go from here. Sound is a little eerie, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I know I say I'm not gonna lie. I need to stop saying I'm not gonna lie, but, but it's, it's, a, it's a little creepy. Um, and and it, it's terrifying. I'm not playing at night this time. Last time I was playing at night, and uh, it, it, it was a little, it got a little scary at one point. I, I kind of had a jump scare, and it wasn't even a big jump scare. Just some water. How do I get up there? Um, okay, I guess I can't get up there yet. But some water rushed out of, uh, of a faucet in it, and it kind of scared me in the game. Oh, I have a little light. Look at that. That's nice. I can't jump up. I wish I could, like, pop out of the water. Like you see submarines or something like that. Oh! Okay. So I have learned that those little anchors right here, I can hold them. Oh! Oh, look at that! Yep, that's right. I'm doing stuff. Okay, we're gonna pull this over with us, though. Yeah, insured gamer. Uh, if uh, if you didn't tune in last time, I, I am an insurance or was an insurance agent. Still work at an insurance company. Just a normal gamer. I'm not by any means a pro gamer. I just enjoy playing games. Uh, games like this, man. You know, on on computer, it's hard to jump and press that interact button. So there we go. Uh, but yeah, just. Uh, work for an insurance company, normal guy, like to play some games, uh, and myself and my friends would tell you that I am not by any means a pro gamer. <laughs> there are a few games that, oh, here's my ship. There are a few games that I'm good at, uh, and I, I do like games you know, kind of like this. This is very interesting. New game, kind of new concept. I love water games, and so this kind of piqued my interest. And I have no clue what to do here. I love that I've got a ship, though. Okay, I'm, I'm guessing if I jump on this, I'm fixing to go down. If I can jump on it. Oh, doggy. Here we go. Oh, boy. Well, I got an achievement on Xbox. I heard that. Oh, oh. That's a large ship. And here's the thing, you know, uh, yeah, I mean, if I, if, if, if this was real life scenario, the world just flooded, I was the only one that I've seen in existence so far. Let's push this forward, okay. Sure, I'd probably steal this, but this, but this, this Joker's fixing to steal this sucker. I mean, do we, is this really what we should be promoting? Um, interact. Oh, gosh. This is awesome. <laughs> uh, so, 
little bit of history. I've actually been... Oh, no, I don't... Um, I'm not ready for this. Oh, no, 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 no. I am not ready for this. Sail's down. Or up. I mean, on this ship, it's down. Um, okay, I, I do want to go a little bit further because... Oh, no! <laughs> uh, I do want to go a little bit further because the camera angle... Okay, I see a little ship icon down there too, which is kind of cool. Okay, off we go. Let's just get out of this building and then we'll kind of take a little bit better look around the ship. I wish I could, is there, oh, what about this? Okay, is this how we anchor it right here? Yes, it is. Oh, there's another button that popped up, great. Okay, let, let, let's, let's, let's hold up, hold, hold, hold your horses. We are not ready to go. <laughs> We're not ready to go for that yet. I'm glad I can't die by jumping off. That's gonna come in handy. Oh, no, 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 stay up. Okay, there we go. Uh, so this is my ship. Oh. Yeah. Okay, okay, so if I go out here, kind of nice little, oh yeah, this is, that's nice. Okay, uh, <laughs> you know, they just, they just, plopped me down in a ship um and i i'm, I'm gonna be honest i'm i'm not i don't know that i'm ready to to, to go yet because uh, i don't even know i mean i haven't even been inside the ship so, okay i want to i want to go in here how do i get in here okay let's uh all right, let's 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 keep going here. Uh, I did notice on the no, damn it, I'm gonna have to get used to that. Not not clicking this button. Okay, there we go. Let's turn the volume down for y'all a little bit. The volume got kind of louder. There we go. Okay, stop clicking the button. <laughs> All right. Okay, don't run into the button. Jump before. Um, so yeah, I, I have actually sailed quite a few times now, uh, just a two man, uh, sailing vessel, a two man boat rather, <laughs> a two man ship. I don't know if you call a two man boat a ship, but, uh, yeah, I've been sailing a couple times. It's, it's actually pretty fun to learn the ins and outs of what a ship can do, what, a how to sail, how to use the wind. Uh, this game looks pretty straightforward because usually in the back here you would have a line that would be holding the sail straight. I guess that's the line right above me right here. But there's usually a line back there that's that's holding the sail straight but usually the line's like connected all the way back here or something. Um, but let's, uh, at least in a, in a two-man, now if you go bigger than that it's a little bit different. You have the types of, types of boats that you're wanting to do. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this lever can I pull this lever? What is this lever? Oh, oh, look at that! Oh, yeah, oh, shoot! Oh, here we go. This is how, okay, okay. So this is how we're gonna control. Yeah, okay, so that is the, uh, like I was saying, you, you have a rope that usually controls the main sail and that was it back there. Oh, gosh, okay. We got you, I got you. So how do I? Okay, so that automatically goes up. So yeah, that is the rope right back there that usually con controls the main sail as far as how much you want to let it out uh, to get some wind going. I like it that it's got the little flag up here too. If I push this button now, oh, yep, it auto, uh, does it automatically go up? No, where'd the wind go? Okay, so this is, I think what it does is it t that flag that's up kind of at the mast, it tells me where the wind is and how much I am catching of the wind. If you'll notice that that little flag is going up and down. Oh, okay, yeah, there we go. Pick it up right there. Uh, and I'm gonna, I, I, I haven't even noticed where we are right now. <laughs> There's, I'm, I'm not even looking at the background. I'm looking at my ship. But he, yeah, that nice little flag right there kind of tells you where you're going. Now, if I just if I just hit this, will it like nope, it won't stop anything. 
Oh gosh, I hit. Oh, that's awesome. You, you come in contact with the environment. Okay, so that's kind of a quick release. If I just release that, I stop. So see to zoom, and I hit the button again. Great. Love it. Let's click this button again. Get it back up again. That's going to be annoying when I'm in the middle of trying to get away from something. That's going to be real annoying if I hit that button in the middle of it. All right. Jump down again. Let's go ahead and start off. Now, there's only one direction that I'm going. And so... I guess I really can't go... Okay, well, I want to keep it right about there. That looks good. I guess I can't go backwards. You can only go forwards. Great. Great. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, that just, that just... Okay. Oh, did I break it? Oh, no. There's sparks flying. I just broke the thing. Five minutes into the game and I broke it. Okay. Let's get this back up and running. I mean, do I, oh, do I need to, <laughs> can I repair? There's sparks flying here. I mean, obviously they put that, <laughs> that bridge there to show you that you can take damage on the ship. All right, let's get back up and going again. I, I really don't like the sparks flying though. All right, so if we see something coming, are the, are the sails a little bit more damaged than they were? I feel like the sails have holes in them now. Okay, so know that if a... If a, something is in our way, we have to drop the sails really quick. Okay. Duly noted. And you drop them by interacting with that. And we're still in, like, a, I guess a, a bay here. Uh, so, again, we don't know too much about what's going on other than, okay, nice, we're pushing. I like the interaction with the, uh, with the world here, the, the boat, the ship. Oh, no, that's not good. Release. Okay. I like the interaction with the world, how it was pushing things. I guess we get off here. We're going to have to lift this some, some way. But we don't know too much about what's going on in the world other than it's definitely flooded. Um, I mean, obviously. Uh, some random stranger basically left a boat in the garage, so that's fun. All right, uh, what do we need to do here? We can use this as a sled. <laughs> there's, a, oh, there's a bunch of buttons here, and I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay, let's... Let's push this button first, see what this says. Okay. Okay, we we have a short in the system. Oh, act, oh gosh. <laughs> okay, so it obviously wants us to cut, I would assume, right there. Let's, uh, let's bring our... Oh, I didn't mean to push it. Wait! I got it. <laughs> Got it. Uh, that's cool. What do I do with this now? Um, okay. I see that there's a button up top as well. Um, can I jump up here? Can't push that. It won't let me interact with that. Um... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Oh, oh, no, do I have to swim? We're getting into open waters. I don't, I don't really like that. Okay. wonder, can I... Nope, can't take that back to my ship. Can I press the button again? Let's see what that does. Let go. Um, nope, that's it for that button. <laughs> so we're obviously going to do something with this log. This is broken. There's something up there that I want to get to. 
Uh, one of the things that was bothering me on my last video is uh, there was an opportunity to just zoom in, and there was a like a flower pot, and or, or something. And um, can I get back up on? I hope I can. There was a flower pot, and I felt like it was meant to to do something, but um, I don't know what. How far can I go? I definitely don't want to go too far. And, you know, maybe one day I can play Subnautica with y'all because it, it's amazing how much that game, uh, you, you get immersed into the game. And I, I don't know, there's another word for it uh, other than immersion, like, uh, it's not like equilibrium or something, but there's another word like when you feel the emotions of it. Like, I know that I'm playing a video game, but when I go into the deeper water, like, my heart starts racing a little bit. <laughs> And it, it is awesome. Like, that's awesome when a video game can do that for you. I'm getting that a little bit here, too, as well. Like, going underneath the ship. Like, uh, I, I've been swimming, you know, underneath docks, underneath boats. And you, you kind of have that sense, that eerie feeling, eerie sense. I'm kind of getting that out of this game as well. Getting that, like, um, not my chest getting tight, but, you know, feeling a little bit of the chills. Okay, this is still broken. And, okay, we got to fix that somehow. Um, I don't know what to do from here. I, and I feel like there's more to the ship, too. Okay, let's, let's go back up here. I, pr I probably pulled that prematurely. Can I, like, get ramming this? I want to... Mm. Oh, oh, now I'm stuck. Okay, here we go. Okay, go! Go! Nope, not that way. All right, let's lug this back. Even though I know I, know I can't go very far, let's lug it back. Yep, that's as far as that goes. I mean, I couldn't take my sail up here. And I, I feel like I should... Come on, I know I can get up there. Look like an idiot doing that. Uh, I, oh, well, <laughs> there was a door here. <laughs> you, were, you were probably looking at me like, yeah, why don't you know? Why don't you just jump? <laughs> but, okay, this this is good. What is this? I know there's a zoom button. Is it Z, X, no R, C is zoom out. V maybe V. <laughs> okay, this is good. What is this? Let's let's. I want to take it down here. Oh. Something happened. Uh, whoa! Okay, if you know, oh, got another achievement on Xbox. If you notice, one of the, the one of the power core thingies um, went away on that. Uh, so there, it was totally full. And what is going up with my hair? Like, man, you need a haircut. Okay. One of those things was full. How do I drop it? Okay, there. All right, here we go again. Let's move you out of the way. I'm going to take you over here because I... We, we got to... I, I feel like we're doing something with this. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, you know, I bet that what that was is just to get us up there. Okay, let's try it again. Yeah. Yeah. Move it out of the way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, did I not put the sails down? Oh, gosh. Can your ship leave without you? I want to pick this back up. Okay. Oh. Oh, I'm still alive. Okay. I wonder if I can use this to the ship. Oh, put it down. I learned my lesson the first time. Okay. Yep. Yep. I'm fixing it. All right. Uh, I'm going to put this in the, I'm going to call it the captain's quarters down here. Uh, yeah, this is the captain's quarters. Yeah. Uh, sure. But we'll call that the captain's quarters for now. I mean, once we, you know what? I wonder if we can use this to get in. Can we? No. Okay. Can I? Okay. I can climb up here. I, I also notice on the front there is a, uh, looks like there's a port or something. Um, nope, okay. See, like that, that thing right below me and on the ship, it looks like it t 
turns in some way. I really, like, I'm sure there was probably a way to get into the ship, <laughs> like in the inside, but I have no clue what that is. Um, maybe I can go under the ship and look. Okay. Oh, here, here we go. This is something right here, but I don't know what. Can I go up in here? Nope, can't go up in there. Yeah, kind of, yeah, we need a name. We need a name for the ship. That's that's what it is. So if you, if you've got a name, um, <clears throat> if you've got a name for me, uh, you know, uh, I, you know, comment in in the comments below. Don't go down on me again. Uh, comment in the comments below uh, and and tell me what you think a good name is. Yeah, so so that's been it for for this episode. Uh, we're gonna get sailing again here shortly. That's been it for this episode of Far. Uh, let me know in the comments. You know, take take your time and 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 uh, you know, tell me in the comments what you're feeling. How how are you feeling? How are you feeling about the game? Do you like this game? Do you want to see more of this game? Uh, it's a puzzle game, obviously. Uh, I wonder if we're going to get to interact with some people. Uh, I plan on continuing it for a little bit. So, uh, you know, let me know how you think. Uh, but yeah, this has been The Insured Gamer. It's been fun uh, playing this with you. See you next time.